For 92 years, the Savoy Theatre has had a long and proud history in the performing arts field in Kabecha. With the change of times, the theatre has decided to rebrand from the Gilbert and Sullivan Society and will now be known as the Impact Community Theatre. The president of the society, Rose Kalpa, says that it was very clear that the audience had no connection to the Gilbert and Sullivan name, with many people having no idea what GNS was. Well, it became very obvious quite a few years ago now that we had moved very far beyond the Port Elizabeth Gilbert and Sullivan Society. We didn't do Gilbert and Sullivan shows, nobody even knew who they were. Um, and it seemed that the branding on the box was not what was in the box. So it, it was a process that started in about 2018, 2019, when we started to really see the impact that we were making on people's lives and, and how it was way more than just coming along to do a show. We were doing workshops, we were doing so many different types of shows. Uh, we were nurturing people, we were mentoring people. And it seemed that we really needed to find a new brand that really summed up what we did. And, and impact was the first word that came to mind. A lengthy process to get the new branding right has culminated in a logo that reflects both the past and the future of the community theatre in Nelson Mandela Bay. The Greek theatre masks joined with an African mask signifies the broad range of people that impact works with. The colour green represents new beginnings, new growth and renewal. First of all, the logo for me means innovation, um, keeping things new and just to remind everyone that we really are making an impact in the community. Um, although there are little details like the incorporation of the European and the African styles and the colours that Rose spoke about earlier, um, about new beginnings, the green that symbolises new beginnings and the contrast of the yellow and the purple, overall it's just all about making an impact. Impact Community Theatre has a multi-genre music festival coming up on the 24th of May until the 2nd of June along with other productions later on in the year. We've got two big productions coming up. Um, we've got a newly formed music festival, Sing Out Loud festival, uh, something very new to us. We've never done anything like that before. And um, after that we are going to be doing our big production for the year, which it is safe to announce it now. It's going to be Greece. Um, and the auditions for Greece are actually next weekend on the 11th of May. I'm really looking forward to uh, the Sing, Sing Out Loud um, festival that we're doing. Uh, that's going to be between the 24th and 26th of May and then the 31st and the 2nd 31st of May and 2nd of June. So I'm really looking forward to that because it's it's an amalgamation multi-genre music festival. So that's really exciting. And of course, Greece. The management team has been working hard to make sure that the people of Kabecha have a number of entertaining shows to look forward to in the future. Reporting for MPK News, I am Khumelo Kyanji.